EA Sports WRC 2024 season expansion trailer is here. Today I just wanna break down some things from the trailer to see what to expect and what not to expect. And after that I'm gonna check the notes so we can get a detailed look to what's coming. Right from the start we are told that the two new locations are Poland and Latvia, which was kind of obvious because when they announced the new 2024 expansion, they also told that the new locations will be updated to the 2024 WRC calendar. We can already see the 2024 Ford livery. Here we can see the 2024 livery for the GR Yaris. Here's Hyundai with the 2024 livery. Oh, but look who's here. The WRC2 Yaris. Which, if you look at the poll I made uh, about two months ago, when they first uh, told us about the new the new stuff that's coming, was the most wanted car from the upcoming DLC. And out of 138 votes, the GR Yaris Rally 2 came first. Okay, we can already see the new Ford the Rally 3 Ford, WRC Junior, with the new liveries and all. Oh, here is Norbert and Francesca's livery as well. Shout out to my fellow Romanians for winning in Greece, and congrats for taking the second place on the entire WRC Junior Championship. More liveries for the Toyota. Ooh, Oliver Skoda looking good. And more liveries for the Rally 2 cars. I'm looking forward to this expansion, which will be available in 8 October 2024. Now let's check the notes to see more information about the new expansion, the new location, Rally Latvia. The other location is Rally Poland, which I really missed from Dirt Rally 2. I always, I always enjoyed Poland and, and it's really, really fast stages. Five new cars. I was really curious if they are changing the car completely or if they're adding new cars. I hope that they're adding the new cars not changing them so we can have the 2024 and 2023 models as well for the Yaris Rally 2 and the Ford Fiesta Rally 3 Evo it's obvious that it's just a new car okay so next we have 52 new liveries and crews in addition to the new cars and locations mentioned above the location and car content pack contains over 50 liveries so 50 vehicle liveries maybe they're talking about the all the liveries because we saw some teams change liveries from event to event the latest examples i can give you is toyota changing the liveries for the drivers for rally finland and in the future packs which will come one in winter 2024 or 2025 and the other one in spring 2025 we will see two new routes to the existing locations from the base game. One is for Rally Monte Carlo and another one for Rally de Portugal. Um, and the other one, which will offer two tracks in Sweden, Umeå and Umeå Sprint, and another one in Rally Greece. That's very few, I'd say. About two months ago when they announced the season expansion, I was thinking about a lot more stages, but I can see we're only getting five. More EA Sports WRC reveals coming soon. Nothing about the price tag or anything. So that's it for now. I'm really looking forward to the new cars, to the new locations. And I can't wait to go live and drive on the new locations with the new cars on day one. So hit the subscribe button so you don't miss it. And in the meantime, go watch some other videos from my channel, from setup guides to news to gameplays. I've also started memberships, so if you're really struggling on some locations, you can join as chief engineer, tell me the car and the location in question, and I will make a setup just for you. Don't forget to leave a like and comment below what do you think about the new expansion. And as always, see you on the track. Bye bye!